Now, before this video starts, I just want to mention that 40%, around 40% of you guys subscribe to my channel. And if you aren't already subbed and you turned on notifications, please do so. And you get to watch videos like this early if you don't look at the notification from my Discord server. <coughs> and make sure to enter the Discord server for a bunch of giveaways. And we're really close to 300 subscribers on the channel. We're going, we're getting there pretty quickly now. And... I already have like 277, something like that. It's, we're getting close. And once I do hit 300, I will be doing another Nitro giveaway. And uh, the link to the server is in the description, as always. And uh, so thank you guys for 500 members. As you can see from the video's title already, today's video is only about increasing your power level and save the world. And if you needed help with that or you just don't know what to do, I got you. Just watch this video and you'll know what to do. The first one that's kind of like longer, it takes you a, lot, a long time to like max out and a long time to get research points is your research. Your research will significantly boost your power level every time you fill any of the four stat bars. I have everything maxed so I can't really show you what it is but like just the little marks every time you level, every time you fill the bar up, it'll go back to empty, and then your power level will be boosted. And it will also, in turn, allow you to deal more damage and have more health and shield. Like, Fortitude increases your health. Um, offensive will do weapon damage. Resistance does shield and shield regeneration rate. And Tech is ability damage, trap damage, and healing rate. Although completing missions will passively increase your power level by gaining XP and evolution materials, the highest rarity survivors are really what you're looking for. They are the main way to get to the max power level, which is like 131 or higher. And as you can see in my survivor squads, all my survivor squad leads are mythic and the rest are legendary, although some are mythic as well. And because of the mythic and legendary, they will give you the highest fort status, or like the highest fort stats and like the bonuses for your power level that you can get. And this is an absolute necessity if you want to get to the highest power level that you want. And as you can see, some of them are supercharged as well, but even though they are supercharged, a soup, one supercharger doesn't really doesn't do much to your power level at all but when you start putting on a bunch of them they start to add up quite quickly and the and the superchargers is again why you would see somebody higher than 131 and if you are really wondering how you would get those high power level or those high rarity survivors is a lot of times the survivors like the legendary ones will be like in the item shop or in a, like an x-ray llama all right but the and sometimes you do get mythic survivors in llamas too and the best way to get the mythic leads is by finding them in these 140 plus four player zones because sometimes they will be like a mission alert, like where you can see like the re-perk and the uh, schematic XP in the eye of the storm. That's where you would see them. And I'm also not too sure about this. Somebody may have to clear this with me, but I think leveling up sometimes will give you uh, extra fort bonuses. And the way you would level up is just by completing missions, just as much missions as you can. So, yeah. Also, everybody, if this video did help you out, make sure to drop a like down below and join the Discord server with the link in the description. And I would really recommend subscribing to the channel if you haven't already. I just really want to hit 300 subscribers because we've been stuck. I've been stuck at 200 for so long, and it's just I'm I'm, I'm finally seeing some growth on my channel for once, and it's it, it's it's exhilarating a bit and um you know more videos coming out soon and uh i'll see you in the next one